say when you love someone, you just don't treat them bad. Oh, honey, I feel so sad. Now that I want to be and she crying a heart to me. How could you let this be? I just need time to see where I want to be. Say when you love someone, you just don't treat them bad. Oh, and I feel so sad. Now that I want to be and she crying a heart to me. How could you let this be? I just need time to see where I want to be. Where I want to be. Yeah, bitch, fuck up. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm feeling lovely, bright early in the morning. And um, I'm singing lovely songs. Whore. Oh. <laughs> Game. All right, Mr. Teleferro, how's everybody doing out there? All right, my dog, Lucci. He got caught up in a little bit of trouble last night. Um, I don't know what the hell Black Youngster was doing. I can't wait to talk to this damn fool. Next time I catch up with this nigga and do an interview, with him about these damn house parties that he's been throwing on the West Coast. This damn fool black youngster threw a house party and he posted the entire thing on Snapchat. All right, you had chicks eating each other out. It was going down at this house party. He had a bit of everything going on at this house party. And um, I'm guessing with YF and Lucci, in some sort of a relationship or talking tough to the daughter of Lil Wayne, Regine Carter. And if Regine seen just half of what I seen on Black Youngster's Instagram story that has now been deleted and removed by Instagram, by the way, if Regine seen half of what I seen, she probably wasn't too happy with YFN Lucci. I don't know what kind of arrangement they got in their situation, but I would imagine that don't include throwing dollar bills at strippers vaginas on Instagram when you're in the public and people can record you because you already know what come with that. No matter if Regine cool or whatever Lucci do, he a grown man, whatever. It's the fact that everybody got to go comment on her page. Look at your man. Look at what your man did. So, you know, it probably got messy for Lucci. And um, the shade room started posting pictures of at Youngster. This nigga had a freaking boxing ring at the freaking... At, the strippers were in the boxing ring, right? So I'm guessing it got messy. And I'm guessing, um, with everything being recorded, Regine Carter got upset at a man for making her look like a clown. So, I hear fan Lucci had to change some things up. Fellas, y'all know how it is. When you get in trouble with your girl, it's certain strikes that hold more weight than other, others. And maybe this is one of his big strikes. The brother made an announcement on his Twitter account. He said, I'm deleting all my pics off Instagram. LOL, y'all trying to wig me. No more stripper parties for Lucci. So I'm guessing the brother got in trouble with his chick and he has took the notion of making sure this doesn't happen again by not attending any more stripper parties with Black Youngster. I'm sure Black Youngster is the friend and I know they watch my videos. I'm sure Youngster is the friend that all your chicks don't want you to hang around when you're in a relationship because he's the bad friend. He's the always ready to turn up friend. He's the nigga that got one of the biggest twerk records in the country, friend. You don't want, your, your girls don't want you hanging around that friend. Every time you hang around that friend, you get in trouble because that friend is nothing but trouble. And I'm guessing Black Youngster got YF and Lucci in nothing but trouble last night at this lit as LA party that ended um, with strippers eating each other out on Instagram. Thank y'all for the time, let's put. I don't take it for granted. YFN Lucci announces that he will not be attending any more stripper parties with Black Youngster or anyone else for that, Marty. No more stripper parties for him because Youngster did the most and y'all don't know how to act, all right? Y'all go to these parties and y'all niggas got to throw ones at the... Well, it just was a lot, all right? And for clarity, I'm not saying it was a lot to have fun and do that. I'm saying it was a lot for somebody to be recording it. That's what I'm talking about. Y'all doing stuff and everything gets recorded. I'm out. I want to salute you, homie, you know, for, for building your own thing and doing your own thing, creating your own platform, your own website. I got one life to live out my dreams, and I'm giving this thing all I got. I interview celebrities. I talk sports. I represent the culture. All right now you're turning up. 
on MrTalaferro.com, shawty.